We're joined now by UC Santa Barbara coach Joe Pasternak and student athletes AJ Mitchell and Miles Norris. We ask media to please raise your hand and identify yourself and your media outlet before asking your question. Coach, if you would please start us off with your opening comments and we'll take questions afterwards. Cal Poly is a really good team. They lost 18 in a row, but it's so deceiving because of the margin of victory. Uh, they you know, lost by Irvine by one point and three points. They lost to Riverside in overtime by one point and then did what they did against Long Beach State. Uh, they're a really, really talented team, and they just haven't found a way to get over the top. But we knew it was going to be a really tough game, a dog fight. Um, I thought, you know, in the first half we were kind of shocked. Uh, we couldn't, we were in a new arena, we didn't get good shots, and defensively uh, we didn't play well. But I thought the second half, you know, it really flipped, shooting 54% and then holding them, more importantly, to 34%. That was huge, uh, holding them one of 12 from three. They hit 10 threes on Monday night, and so that was huge. Obviously, Miles and AJ, two guys next to me, had huge second halves. First half, they, they were really slow to come out of it. And, um, you know, that sometimes happens in a tournament. But I'm really excited about how they responded in the second half. If you're joining on Zoom, please use the raise hand feature. We'll go ahead and take questions here in the room first. Hi, Mike Klan, uh, ABC Santa Barbara. Uh, Coach, it seemed like in the first half you were a step slow, you guys. It seemed like every time you guys were trying to drive, they would cut you off. Second half, the lane really opened up for you guys. Is that how you kind of see it? Yeah, you know, we didn't move the ball in the first half. That was the biggest problem is it was just sticking on one side and just kind of we were in a daze. And I thought we needed to get used to it. Our guys got used to it and kind of uh, thought it really moved the ball, shared the ball in the second half. Hey, Coach, uh, Derek Clark, KCSB Sports. Uh, that second half was huge for you guys. There was a run there immediately when the second half started. It was a 5 nothing run. Uh, it seemed that you guys had turned up the energy considerably, and you guys were able to get stops, uh, which fueled your transition game. How much did those uh, two things factor in your ability to get off the high in, this, in the second half no, and, and carry huge. it to the end? No, it was huge. The first couple minutes of the second half, I thought we had a renewed energy and um, got stops, transition, uh, and then, you know, through, towards the middle of the second half, I thought Miles and AJ really took over the game. Uh, Vincent Vanceful, KCSB uh, Sports. Uh, question for AJ. So, in the first half, you had two points and ended up finishing the game with 24. Coming out of the locker room, what was kind of your mindset? Was it a mission to try to be more aggressive offensively, or did you just kind of let it come? Uh, probably just let the game come to me. I was... Um, didn't have a good first half, uh, but I was more worried about winning. So I was just like, let's find the open man. And I had to take some shots. I took them, make them, and that's it. Hi, Cameron Curl in KCSB Sports. Question for Miles. Miles, in the first half, you only took four shots from the field, uh, all from deep. We saw in the second half, you really made it. Did, it, did you really make it your mission to, to drive to the paint and really force the defense to collapse on you? Uh, yeah, definitely. You know, I, I know I can shoot the ball well, but, you know, the shot's not going to fall every night. Uh, I know I can get to the rim as well. So once I see my shot not falling, uh, try to do something else, get to the basket. You know, it worked out for me in the second half, helped the team get the win. But, you know, my guys just gave me the ball, getting spaced out, spacing the floor, it allowed me to drive to the rim. Anything else? Got one more. I'll just uh, I'll just mic. Um, AJ, uh, when you get this win, how much does it really loosen up you guys now? It seemed like you guys were kind of tight, maybe a little pressure uh, coming in. I mean, the first tournament game is always a hard one. So happy to have to got the, that we got that dub. Uh, and now just go from there, win the next game. And that's all we're focused on. Great. Thanks so much for your time.